What's up, YouTube? So, I'm here to talk about something. Uh, something that has been on our mind for a while. And what I want to know is, why do you trolls continue to attack me? And why? I, I understand that I may have made some mistakes. And I get that you guys don't like that I don't say what it is. But there's a reason why I don't. There's a very valid reason why I don't. Granted, some of you might not go after me for it. And that is true. Some of you do genuinely want to see me better myself. And I appreciate that. Even if even those of you that don't like me, some of you do want to see me better myself. And I want to do better. I do. But the reason why I will not speak about what went down with Marty or with Tibbs is because I know there's a few out there that would blast me even more and attack me even more than what I've been attacked already. That's why I won't say anything. Because I know what's going to happen. Because I've witnessed it. I have witnessed good people that have made mistakes open up and admit to what they did and they just ruthlessly got ripped apart. And which is why I refuse to do that. But as for people like N-Word Boy, I genuinely have a question for you. And I mean, this is a genuine question, dude. What do you gain by stealing my music? Like, what do you gain by stealing shit that is not yours? What do you gain from that? Hmm? What do you gain from ripping me off? What do you gain from reporting my shit to where I can't do anything? I mean, obviously you get a laugh, but after you get a laugh, what else is there, dude? I don't see the point. I mean, it's funny. People like you and some of y'all other trolls, people like you, N-Word Boy, and others that follow you always sit there and say, oh, get off the internet. Get off the internet. We'll leave you alone if you get off the internet. No, you won't. You'll continue to attack me in real fucking life. It happens every time. Prime example. When I got arrested last year and I stayed off the internet for over six months. What happened? I still got attacked. My family still got harassed. People still showed up to my house. So, no, I'm not going to get off the internet. And second off, I have just as much right to be on here as anyone else. You know, all I've ever asked is for a fair shot to do what I want with my life. Which is work on my music, release my music, and work on and release merchandise for those that actually do enjoy my work. Because believe it or not, there are people out there that do enjoy what I do. Believe it or not. There are actual people out there that do enjoy what I do. And it's not fair that they get ripped off. It's not fair that they don't get to hear my music or get to purchase merchandise that I work my ass off on. That's not fair to them. Oh, right, forget about being fair to me. What about them? 
What about the ones that actually do show support for me and actually want me to do better? I mean, why can't y'all just... Oh, I don't know. Leave me alone and let me do my shit without being attacked. I mean, is leaving me alone and letting me do my job as a content creator really that fucking hard? Is that really that difficult to do? I mean, I don't understand. I genuinely do not understand the point and what you guys do. I don't understand the point in it. Because all you guys do is hurt people and push people to suicide. I mean, what, do you think it's funny that you push people to suicide? Do you think that's funny? Do you think it's funny that you push people to depression and PTSD every day? Because I don't. I don't find that funny. Do you think it's funny that you guys sit there and you waste fucking resources by calling the police and doing welfare checks and all this other shit? No. I don't think it's funny. Do you think it's funny calling random people to our house that don't know that what you guys are doing is fake? And the fact that you piss them off? What, do you think that's funny? Do you think it's funny that you guys are getting innocent people involved? Because I don't. Man, I understand that some of you might hate me. I completely understand that. But that doesn't mean I don't deserve to live my life doing what I want to do. That doesn't mean I don't deserve to live my fucking life in peace. That doesn't mean I don't deserve to live a good life and to be able to do whatever the fuck I want to do in my life. Like I said, I'm not leaving the internet. You guys cannot make me and you are never going to force me off. Because believe it or not, there are people out there that do want to see me succeed and do better. There are a lot of people out there that do want to see that for me. And I want to do better. <clears throat> but in order to do better, I need y'all trolls to back off and leave me the fuck alone. And to let me release my shit. Let me do my job as a content creator. Let me release my music. Let me do what I need to do with merchandise. Because, I mean, you sit there and you say that, oh, you don't have any fans that will buy it. You don't have any fans that will buy the merchandise. Nobody will buy your music. Nobody will buy your merchandise. How do you know that? You don't know that. I mean, if y'all are so fucking sure that people won't buy my merchandise, then let me prove you right. Now, I'm telling you right now, there are people that would buy it. And if you don't think there are, let me prove you wrong. Let me show you that there are people out there that would buy it. Let me show you that there are people out there that do support what I do with my life 
and how I want to be a good content creator and make a living. Let me fucking prove it. I understand that a lot of you guys don't want me to do anything. I understand that y'all, some of y'all don't want me to make a living. And a lot of y'all are saying, oh, get a 9 to 5 job. No, I'm not going to. And even if I wanted to, I can't. Because I already know what would happen. Y'all would, y'all say you wouldn't call up there and get me fired? Yeah, you would. Y'all did it with my biological father. Y'all did it with my friend Brendan. So really, how long would it be before y'all started doing that shit to me? All for a laugh. What I don't understand is what's the point in this? This is this is the this is the one thing I don't understand. The one thing that I've always been like, what the fuck over. Why do y'all want to see me homeless so bad? I mean, what's the point of making someone homeless? It doesn't do them any good. It doesn't fucking prove anything. All it proves is that you guys are a bunch of no life having little assholes. That's all it proves. So honestly... You guys need to leave me the fuck alone and let me do what I need to do to better myself, dude. Let me work on my music. Let me work on my fucking merch. Let me do whatever the fuck I need to do to make money. And just leave me the fuck alone, dude. Because I'm telling you right now, there are people that want to see me do better. So when I say leave me alone, to you trolls, I mean leave me alone. Leave my music alone, leave everything I do alone. Leave my friends and family alone. Let me live my motherfucking life. Let me do what I need to do to make money. So I can live my life. Because I refuse to be homeless. I refuse to go down that fucking road again. Because when I first moved here in Ohio with my family. I was homeless. We lived out of the back of my mom's GMC Jimmy for a year and a half until we got the place that we're in now. And I have no plans on going back to that life. So all I ask is to be left alone so I can do what I need to fucking do. Is that really that much to ask for? Because I guarantee you there's a lot of fucking people out there that would agree with me that that's not that much to ask for. I guarantee it. So, leave me alone. Stop trolling me. Stop going after my fans and my supporters. And stop making it to where I can't do anything. That's all I ask. Is to leave me alone and let me do my job. Peace.